dear students very good morning today lecture number 6 our topic of lecture number 5 continues lecture number 5 was topic about various images formed by lenses in that we wanted to discuss about images formed by convex lens and concave lens we have already started in lecture number 5 if you can remind we have started the topic various images formed by convex lens two images we have already discussed one that was image formed this is just a revision of the previous topic when object was kept at infinite distance and we could see that the image was formed at the focus and it was real inverted and highly diminished that means point like image then we discuss the second one where what we have tried we tried to bring the object nearer to the lens that means the object was kept little away from center of curvature means little further than center of curvature and we could get the image real inverted and smaller before we start today's topic means we continue the topic first in lecture number 6 you may call titles first lecture 6 make the title images <coughs> formed by convex lens then you make this title position of object space position of image nature and size of image today we are targeting third diagram position of object try to understand we are trying to bring object nearer and nearer to the lens first it was at infinite then it was kept further than center of curvature now we are keeping it means we are bringing it nearer that means we are keeping object at center of curvature either you write at position of object at center of curvature or you write c or you can write to f also so object kept at center of curvature or at to f let us try to draw the image first start drawing with me as i told you the first always center line of the lens center line of the lens first then both curved or both spherical surface both spherical surface exactly in the center that is optical center then as you know principal axis passing from optical center a little straight line make it then as you know 
एफ वन टू एफ वन दिस इज एक्चुअली सी टू बट इट इज कस्टमरी टू राइट टू एफ एफ टू एंड हियर टू एफ टू here in this case as i told you always you have to maintain the distance this distance and this distance has to be equal in that point you need to be very very attentive okay let us draw now object is to be kept exactly at center of curvature so we have taken a b s object and we have kept exactly at 2f that is at center of curvature in drawing this diagram you need to be very conscious the first ray parallel to principal axis of after refraction will pass through focus second ray i want to give you one suggestion here the second ray can be taken either you can take passing from optical center without undergoing any type of refraction or you can take this ray also passing from focus then become parallel any ray you can take just now we are taking passing through optical center and here you should be careful that draw diagram perfectly so that the ray need to intersect exactly below 2f okay so second ray passing from optical center without undergoing any refraction both the rays are intersecting here be very conscious and here you can draw image inverted image a dash b dash so where we got the image exactly at 2f so what you can write in position of image at 2f or you can write c or you can write at the center of curvature you can write any way either you write at center of curvature or you write at c or you write at 2f just observing here this is object and this is the image so image and object size look similar so we can say that the image is real inverted real inverted and of same size not down real inverted and of same size okay so diagram number 3 position of the object was at 2f at c at center of curvature we utilize two rays in second ray i have given you option you can utilize the ray passing through focus and then become parallel that can also be taken but you need to be very sure that the image has to get exactly at 2f2 on other side of the lens okay so image is obtained at 2f and what is the nature and size of the image real inverted and of same size understand so third diagram you must have drawn and it is clear now we are moving 
to diagram number 4 as i am clearing the board you may call this title again position of object you must have drawn this diagram now we are moving for the second one okay so just I am erasing this only because now we are moving to diagram number 4 that is position of object diagram number 4 position of object initially it was at infinite then we moved it means we uh, kept it further than 2f that is away from center of curvature then at center of curvature and now we are keeping the object between or the fourth diagram let us place the object at principal focus or at F. You can either write principal focus or you can either write F. Both are equal. Understand? So position of object has been written. Let us draw the diagram with me as usual slim center line for the lens ok two couch surfaces on both the side on both the side couch surfaces then O that is optical center then the principal axis passing from optical center ok passing from optical center as you know the standard way of drawing the diagram F1 and 2F1 similarly F2 and 2F2 now we are keeping object at focus. Object is kept here. Just try to understand. No need to just draw the object here. Because the object is placed at focus. So what happens? Exactly opposite to the diagram number one where the object was kept at infinite distance and the image was obtained at focus here. How you will draw the diagram? Object is placed at F. So the first ray emerging from the object and then becoming parallel. Similarly, second ray emerging from object emerging that means light fall on object and object reflects it understand and becomes parallel that means what the image will be formed at infinite means if the object is kept at focus image will be formed at infinite distance here you can write at infinite and what could be the type of the image so you have to write obviously it is real inverted and larger 
real inverted and larger you can use the word enlarged also understand so this is our diagram number 4 we have kept object at focus that was exactly opposite to the first diagram where the object was at infinite and we were able to obtain the image at focus here the object was kept at focus and we are able to obtain the image at infinite distance and obviously real inverted and enlarged image so dear student this is type of the image number 4 formed by <coughs> convex lens while you draw diagram be very very accurate and sure and try to maintain the distances then and then you are able to get a perfect diagram okay so i think you must have drawn you must have written this data data you must have written you must have drawn diagram whenever you understood one thing in the first the object was at infinite distance we haven't shown it and the image was at focus understand we haven't shown it here the object was kept at focus we are not showing abs the object here and the image also we are not showing so in this two diagram you have to be very very conscious how to draw the image so image number 4 position of object at f image formation image is formed at infinite distance <coughs> and it is real inverted and enlarged clear this diagram now we move to diagram number 5 as i clear the board you just make the titles again diagram number 5 just write position of object then write position of image everything understand nature and size of the image write each and everything and the similar way keep keep gap to draw the diagram now we are taking diagram number 5 object was initially at infinite then further than center of curvature then at uh, at center of curvature then <coughs> at focus now let us take diagram number 5 we are now trying to keep the object between let us take between principal focus and center of curvature f means principal focus 2f means center of curvature position of object let us try to make the diagram as usual center line for the lens as usual to slim curved surfaces for realization of convex lens then o is the optical center then as you know principal axis passing from optical center line sidhi tabhi jo yaadi nahi understand then f1 to f1 at the same time f2 and 2f2 let me extend because i know where the image is going to form tumne pachi khabar hai koi 
you must be in knowledge of this object is kept between focus and center of curvature here object is kept between focus and center of curvature first ray parallel to principal axis and after refraction will pass through focus this ray i have extended okay looking nice the second ray i am giving option from focus then parallel or directly from optical center second ray will pass from optical center and intersect this ray here away from center of curvature on the other side a dash b dash is the image i am just waiting for 1 to 2 minute if you could not have got the diagram correct i am waiting kadach if you are not able to do just erase it draw it again pass ray exactly straight passing through center of curvature definitely you will get the diagram if you can't write again you will be able to get it okay so object was where it was placed between f and 2f and the image is obtained where away from center of curvature on the other side so what can i write in position of image can you guess what you will write away from no need to write center of curvature either you write 2f or you write c away from center of curvature <coughs> and type here you can see this is the object and the image below the principal axis and just comparing both it is looking larger than the object so i can write real inverted real inverted and larger okay real inverted and larger so this is the fifth diagram actually the fourth diagram which we have taken where we have kept the object at focus should be actually number 5 but no problem nahi it's all okay understood right <clears throat> so object here was kept between focus and center of curvature means between c and f or between 2f and f and we are able to object the image exactly away from 2f on the other side my dear student be very very sure regarding one thing kai vastu kaun si cheez par aapko concentrate karna hai whenever you write position of image how many ray diagrams so far we have studied so far we have studied five lens diagram of convex lens every time what you are able to see object was on the left side of the lens and image was obtained on the other side so every time you write position of image like in first case at focus then between f and 2f then at 2f then away from 2f in all diagrams 
यू कैन एड वन वर्ड सपोज हियर अवे फ्रॉम टू एफ ऑन द अदर साइड दैट यू कैन राइट एड टू एफ ऑन द अदर साइड दैट वर्ड कैन बी यूटिलाइज बिकॉज इन केस ऑफ कॉन्वेक्स लेंस ऑल इमेजेस आर फॉर्म ऑन द अदर साइड ऑफ द लेंस ऑब्जेक्ट इज केप्ट ऑन द लेफ्ट साइड and all image are formed on the other side of the lens so here you can add some attribute like away from to f on the other side of the lens bada ma lakhi so in each and every diagram we have done understood so this is position of object between f and 2f i am just waiting for one or two minutes so that if anybody could not be able to draw the diagram should concentrate perfectly and i am trying my best to visual to make perfect diagram so that you can understand it okay so diagram number 5 we have done as per our discussion before i erase the board make all title clear position of object okay then position of image okay then nature and size of image make everything clear first okay right here image nature and size of image so diagram number 6 now where the object is kept between between principal focus f and either i write optical center or o here i can write any word i write o i may write optical center i may write lens all has got the same meaning understand <coughs> position of object between f and o either you write o or you write optical center or you write lens anything you can write so concentrate here as per we were drawing the diagram understand diagram needs to be very neat and clean diagrams let us take center line first center line of the lens always so this is lens okay i will draw slim curves on both the side because we are talking of thin lens where aperture has to be less than the radius of curvature okay so this is optical center then principal axis understood passing from optical center principal axis then as you know f1 okay 2f1 okay then f Two, okay, and two F two. Here, थोड़ो ध्यान आपो, just concentrate. इसमें थोड़ा ध्यान और दो. Object has to be when you draw this diagram, particularly that the object is kept between lens and obviously focus object. लिटल स्मोलर रो करो 
not quite bigger otherwise the two extended ray becomes difficult to meet okay so i draw a small object here object ab understood first ray parallel to principal axis after after refraction pass through focus draw with me pass through focus second ray as you know passing through optical center without any refraction here you can see both the reflected ray and we can call it reflected ray but see both are not meeting here to form the real image so what happens here i am just erasing this uh, for making comfort in diagram you have to extend both the ray on the same side of the lens in their original direction okay both the rays extend they look like meeting here and this is actually the image a dash b dash understand you have to extend both the rays in the similar direction be very sure and this is image where the image is formed away from 2f on the same side position of image away from 2f here you should write as uh, like text on the same side this is very important word in all other diagram on the other side <coughs> how can you guess the type of image this is object and this is image object image object image okay so real inverted no it is <coughs> what you will write <coughs> speak with me virtual return erect return and enlarged or magnified that also you can write magnified understand so image is virtual erect and enlarged or magnified so this is the last image we have studied formed by convex lens so regarding convex lens we have studied six types of lens diagrams understand <clears throat> first object was at infinite then object was further than 2f then object was at 2f then object was between f and 2f then object was at f then object was between f and o six lens diagram you have to prepare understand and in every lens diagram what i told you initially when we were discussing about spherical mirror that whenever you draw any lens diagram remember one thing you have three data position of object position of image nature and size of image how can the mcq can be designed you will be given any one data rest of the two data can be your answer suppose from this diagram if i want to design an mcq suppose i target this i speak in convex lens we get virtual erect and magnified image 
where the image might have been formed to your answer away from 2F on the same side. So out of the three data, one data can be given as a question and rest of the two data can be utilized for asking you any MCQ, any one line at the same time. You should be very sure. Convex lens are known as converging lens. Understand? They are known as converging lens. Understood? So, all images formed by convex lens are over. In lecture number 5, we have drawn two diagrams of convex lens and in lecture number 6, we are able to <coughs> draw four diagrams again of convex lens. Okay, so all ray diagram of this converging convex lens are over. Now we are targeting image formed by concave lens and just clearing the board now just clean we have to study now images formed by images formed by concave lens convex lens is over okay image is formed by concave lens that is what we are going to study now okay let me first write the title here okay this is the title and this is the topic of our target now images formed by images formed by concave lens that is what we are targeting now concave lens images formed by concave lens concave lens actually is also known as as you might be knowing diverging lens that you should know it is known as diverging lens regarding concave lens you have to study <coughs> two types of images only there are no more types of images understand in concave lens so let us try to understand two images formed by concave lens first actually you have to write down before me position of position of object understand position of object at infinity means the object is at infinite distance okay let us try to understand how to make the image as per my guidance first always center line of the lens always center line of the lens let us try to realize ok concave lens here right concave lens slim curve ok and another slim curve inside curve right 
सेंटर लाइन नॉट लुकिंग एक्जेक्टली इन सेंटर थोड़ा ऐसे कर देते हैं दिस इज सेंटर लाइन ओ एस ऑप्टिकल सेंटर एंड देन प्रिंसिपल एक्सिस पासिंग फ्रॉम ऑप्टिकल सेंटर F1 as you know to F1 F2 to F2 as you know object was positioned at infinite distance because the object was positioned at infinite distance as you know no need to show the object just the rays coming from the object suppose the first ray reflected emerging from object and traveling parallel to the principal axis of concave lens this is another ray to make the diagram to comfort in making the diagram what i have written here concave lens is diverging lens so obviously the ray is not going to converge after refraction but it will diverge but when you draw the diverging ray now at that time be very sure first draw dotted line first you draw this way and then extend okay so in fact what happened both the rays after refraction were diverging in this direction diverging but extended back they will pass through focus and here they form the image understood so let us write the position of position of image where the image is obtained at focus at f2 what at what you will add on other side or you can write on opposite side that word will also work and then you will write nature nature and size of image okay what you will write here we are getting a tiny image so you can write here as virtual exactly opposite to first diagram of convex lens where you return real inverted and highly diminished here you will write virtual erect and highly diminished that is point like highly diminished image okay so image is virtual erect and highly diminished understood so this is the first diagram for concave lens the object was at infinite and the image was obtained at focus okay now let us go for the second diagram because in as far as the concave lens is concerned only two diagrams we have to discuss first one we have already discussed where the object was kept at infinite distance and the image was obtained exactly at focus and the image is virtual erect and highly diminished highly diminished means point like image let us try to discuss second diagram i am waiting for 1 minute 
so that you can draw the diagram properly you can understand the data i have written here quite properly and you can also just converse your mind that out of the three data one can be given and rest of the two can be asked to make mcqs okay now let us before i erase all data i am erasing it slowly so if anything is left please draw it and note it down okay let us move from for the next diagram you just write position of object then you write position of image then you write nature and size of image and blank here okay second diagram we are going to discuss now okay position of object now object was initially at infinite distance and now we are bringing the object near to the concave lens near understand so you can just say simply the position of object between infinity and concave right this way also between infinity infinite and lens that means from infinite we are bringing the object nearer to concave lens because this is the only image now we have to make okay let us try to draw between infinity and lens first as you know slim center line for the lens center line then to realize the concave lens a slim dotted line sorry slim curved line on both the side so lens is realized then exactly here optical center then principal axis passing through optical center extend on both side then after you extend at principal axis on both the side lens whenever you draw lens be very very sure that lens needs to be drawn in that curved surface needs to be not quite curved understand for a slim curve now f1 okay to f1 f2 to f2 object <clears throat> let us keep it anywhere you can place the object understand there is no specification of position of the object suppose i keep the object here suppose a b is the object understand first ray parallel to principal axis and will diverge but when you draw this what i suggested you dotted line and then extend and the second ray understand what you have to concentrate here any ray passing from center of curvature understand as well as optical center is never going to be reflect reflected so another ray you should target this passing through center of curvature here you got the image a dash b dash so position of image between where we got the image between understood uh here my dear student let us uh, draw diagram again uh 
diagram could not be made more clear with clarity let us draw it again this is dotted line for the lens don't worry uh, then as usual a uh, concave lens it's okay then curved lines then optical center as you know then principal axis as you know f1 to f1 okay f2 to f2 object keep it here only ab is the object first ray parallel to principal axis and then it will diverge this diverge ray when extended back will pass through focus and another ray passing from optical center without any refraction both the rays are meeting here so this is the image a dash b dash where the image is obtained between it remains the same between o that is optical center and f on the same side that you have to write on the same side and obviously you can visualize this is object this is image so it is virtual erect and smaller virtual erect and smaller so this is second diagram found by concave lens okay my dear students so topic today is clear image formed by so how many images we drawn four images of convex lens and two images of concave lens today's homework note it down homework a general question <coughs> all ray diagram whichever we have done today to be done once again neat and clean diagram with data return position of object image everything nature and size of image up to date homework for today all six lens diagram four of convex and two of concave you have to do understand and send it to associate okay so thank you very much from bharat sir